And next up is a combo breaker from Brody Clark, Barry Schwartz, and Glenn Gabe, who teamed up to cover Google featured snippets that are pulling in multiple contextual links into the featured snippets. And so what is this? Maybe may, You may be asking. You kind of need to see it. And there's a good GIF yeah. that we'll have over in the show notes, marketingclock.com or up on the screen at YouTube. And there's an example of when did Lil Wayne start rapping? <laughs> Amazing example, might I add. And so PPC you sh- Greg would love it, right? Who would? PPC Greg. Isn't he on that song that PPC Greg compared yes, me to? Yes, forever. Yeah. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes. Um, potential Greg of the year. Anyway, <laughs> there is an example in the featured snippet looks normal where it says Lil Wayne's career began in 1991. But underneath the name Lil Wayne, you see dot, dot, dot. And when you hover over it, you get more information. And this information does not come from the featured snippet. So a site has won the featured snippet, has that show up, and then the first word in the featured snippet, Lil, L-I-L, is underlined and goes to a different site, in this case, dictionary. I don't like it. And then there's more things that are un- are, are underlined and go off to other sites. And this is a problem. Like you can be like, hey, cash money records. I want to see what that is. You hover over it, you see cash money records. So you're seeing more information. And then it's different links that are being sent to different sites. Yeah. And this is a problem. I don't like it one bit. And this comes on the heels of Brody Clark again was talking about some of these auto-generated web stories that were showing up that Google had just created based off of machine learning and artificial intelligence, AI, ML, and just mashed that together. And now it just really seems like they're trying to not have search engine results. I don't like this at all. No, people are already mad enough that like people, the featured snippet, nobody clicks through. Now you can send people to a completely different site. And you win the featured snippet just to lose instantly. Yeah. It's crazy. And then I'm just picking hairs here or splitting hairs. Picking hairs. Ew, what am I? Like a... That's like, like a, a nervous that? disorder people have. And, and don't you... um they don't, their don't eyelashes? Like primates do that as well, right? <laughs> okay. No? Are we primates? I don't know. I mean, it just said I was. Anyway, <laughs> so the example that they gave wasn't good. The example that when I hovered over Lil Wayne, <laughs> I got a dictionary.com link that said... Who is Tanucci? Famous people by dictionary.com. Who is Tanucci? It's Lil Wayne. Oh. So it says, what does Tanucci mean? Tanucci, or Lil Tanucci, is a nickname for Dwayne Michael Carter Jr., a.k.a. Lil Wayne. He has that, so many helping. aliases. He's like PPC Greg. But that's not helping. <laughs> that's not helping PPC Wayne. Like, <laughs> this is like a bad example, too, that you're doing on top of a good example. It's just, it's it's all too much to yeah. me. And I hate where it's going. It's going to be less clicks. And I don't know. I I was way too whiny last week, so I'm not going to whine too much here. Yeah, it's not Google Ads, but I feel like this borders on criminal here. Yes. Hashtag criminal. You want the featured, you think you want the featured snippet, and they're just making it not good. I'm not, I'm not with this. I'm not not with Tanucci, Lil Wayne. I'm not thankful for this. (laughs) I'm not thankful for this either. Like what you saw? Of course you did. If you're looking for more, Marketing and Clock releases new episodes every Friday with the Digital Marketing News of the Week. You can subscribe wherever you consume your podcasts. Or click to watch the full episode, the next news story, or read all the articles from the show.